So this is Asher, and he's one of the uh, COVID-19 detector dogs. Asher the Spaniel has 350 million sensory receptors in his nose. The government is paying half a million pounds to see if he and five other sniffer dogs can be trained to sniff out people with COVID-19. The dogs will be screening individuals up to 250 people an hour. Now, this is a, a, a 0.5 of a second sniff, and they will be reliably able to tell whether somebody's carrying the virus and therefore needs to take a medical test to be isolated. This is how the same dogs were trained to detect people with malaria. Odour collected from patients' clothing is placed in one of eight containers. The dog gets a treat if it can find it and sit down. For the COVID-19 training, the samples will come from people who have the virus but no symptoms. And if the training works, the dogs could screen 250 people an hour as they arrive at UK airports. Well, I think it's really important to think about this COVID-19 as a problem that's not going to go away and it'll be with us for a year or two. So in order to prevent infections sparking off into this country, we need to have good border security to identify people coming in with, with the virus. And if our dogs can, do, can pick up people, I think that would be a very strong thing to do. The researchers say they'll know if dogs can be trained to detect people with coronavirus by September, in which case hundreds could be working in UK airports by the end of the year. Gerard Tubb, Sky News.